what is EMG in your conduction? This is a diagnostic test that's going to help further evaluate your condition, depending on whether you have arm pain from a disc herniation or if we're looking for nerve damage, or it could be in your leg as well. In order to do this test, one has to be certified. Now, myself, I've had an extra three years of training in board certification of chiropractic neurology, as well as an extra year in a diplomate of board certification in electrodiagnosis. I'm not only able to perform this test, but I'm also able to interpret this test and give a written report whether you're a current patient in this office or you're a patient of another physician, whether it's a specialist like a medical neurologist or maybe you're a patient of another chiropractor in this area. And we just need to figure out what's going on and I can give that report to your doctor and give them the best opinion so that they know how to work up your case. So let's talk about some of these things that this test is able to do for you. Let's say we're looking at the arm, and maybe we're thinking you might have something like carpal tunnel symptoms. Many people know about carpal tunnel. So, when we're talking about carpal tunnel, you have that pain in your hand. Sometimes you wake up at night with that pain. We're going to do this test. First, we start at the wrist. And we just use a little bit of an impulse here to see how that nerve is firing. We want to know how fast that nerve is firing. And then we look up here because we want to see the speed as well. We also want to know maybe sometimes that is coming from your neck. You might already have an MRI result that we can pair that with. So we can see, is it talking to your brain here? Is there something else going on here? We also use EMG to see what's going on in the muscle. So we get that component as well. We can do the same thing in the leg. Sometimes you might notice that you feel weakness in your arm. Perhaps you're dropping things. Maybe you feel like your muscle doesn't look like it's the same size from one arm to the other. This test can determine all of these things to give you an answer as to what is going on. Same thing happens in your leg. Maybe you're dragging your leg. Maybe the leg doesn't look the same size in your calf. Maybe you feel like your toes are dropping. Whatever the case may be, we're able to determine all of these things through nerve conduction studies and EMG. Thank you.